Now, one thing I keep telling myself I'm going to do is talk less when I'm playing and play more. Uh, whether that works or not, we'll find out. This is a very frustrating move, this one. Um, let's, well, if I go there, the knight comes here. So I'm going to play f6, the two main breaks. But actually now bishop d3 is probably a good move. Uh, a little bit scary already. Uh, this is not the right way to play this this line. Typical. Always play so hesitantly in the first game. A6. Yeah, I, I, you know, I need to start playing better here. Knight G5 is is a scary move here. I can go F5 and just be a little bit worse. I want to play Queen C7 and Castle Queenside, but um, my opponent now opening it up, which makes a lot of sense here. So. I need to calculate carefully here to avoid being just worse. Um, maybe I do take with a pawn here even. Um, and I'm still a little bit scared, but if I can get castled one side and into the game, I'll be a lot happier. So bishop e7, I have to play to block the e file. And I'm probably just slightly worse here because my isolated pawn, but nothing too horrendous at the moment. Um, Going to throw the knight in there, but I don't know. This is not really what I want. I've been struggling a bit with a French recently, which is... Which is a bit annoying. Um, I need to do a little bit more work on on my French defence. It hasn't been going very well now. Certainly worse here. I'm a little bit scared of my position because of diagonals like this towards my king. And if I ever go here, he's got bishop h2. Oh no, my knight comes back to e4. So this is not. A position that's very easy to win with that's for sure but let's just try to get rid of the immediate danger in my position here first if I can so I'm really yeah so he wants to go Queen here and then I might have to bring my Knight back to this square but it's all very scary stuff I'm relying on the Knight coming back here to block a lot of my opponents really aggressive ideas like bishop h7 king takes queen c2 check that's fine so now he's pestering my knight and threatening some problems so can't see anything better about coming back to this square and where do i put this bishop okay so he's hitting a couple of pawns here I can't and he's threatening to take my knight flipping heck is this just losing already uh, it, was, it was looking really bad this opening such a dodgy start sometimes I have and the opening just went very badly wrong here I can't see an easy way to deal with this so gonna take here but it's all looking very wrong at this moment in time this position and simple move but a good move and he's threatening a lot of things here um, unfortunately for me so I've got to just try and find a way to to not lose on the spot which is easy easier said than done in a very tricky position I can't I, you know this is this is horrendous for me actually <laughs> oh god what, what am I even doing okay I, I have to not lose a piece but the opening went entirely wrong and so I've just got to bring the knight back here after the check 
and grovel. Now I might get checkmated here if he sacks a piece, but what can we do? I've got queen f6 and I'll be happy if I get out of this just to pawn down because it was certainly looking a lot worse than a mere pawn in the position and I'm speaking slowly because I don't have a lot of time either <sighs> his knight is very strong I can't take that off my dark squares are too weak I can't move my bishop here so it's a very tricky position I need to try and do something along this line but I'm just trying to hold on still so far and this is not a good move but simply lacking time in the position can I do this? No. Flip. And the knight is coming in, but what can I do? What can I do? What could I do there? So I'm a pawn and the exchange down, but I've avoided getting checkmated. That is the only good, mu good news here. There's no other good news in the position at all. Um, but we're still fighting are we not really <laughs> torture Tuesday is back and rocking got to try to play as quickly as I can here My God! Oh, 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 oh. oh that was that was that was just scary. I mean, uh, that that was horrendously light. Maybe maybe with a win like that, it's like ah, oh, maybe it is going to be my day today. Anyone think it might be my day? That was crazy, okay, but you've got to take every win and you've got to put up as much challenge as you can. The final position is the best position I've had all game. Uh, because I'm threatening Rook G2 check. Um, and suddenly my three pieces are working very well together. So I really had to struggle to get to this position, but I'm also threatening, no, I'm not threatening that, but Rook, Rook here check is very annoying for him. Then I can start picking up these pawns and my position is actually just talking about the position is not horrendous it's not horrendous I mean I don't know if that was totally dirty because I kept fighting until the end from a very bad position but I got I mean I, I, I played this knight a3 people are starting to play this move against me and I, I'm not remembering the right line here my next move here is just really bad because you play this when the bishop is on e2 but playing it here just looks so dodgy. And after bishop d3, well, I had to t I had to not play another slow move. I'm playing beginner mistakes. I had to try and take this pawn. Hello, Chess Pats UK. Uh, Matt the Paletto pawn. Um, oogie, oogie. Campfire stew. Um, and never in doubt, says Oliver Nee. There was a lot in doubt there. Campfire stew saying the French is hard to play at speed. You know what? I find everything hard to play at speed, basically. Uh, Fiat looks here. Gonna win TT then? I find that unlikely, shall we say. I find it unlikely. Uh, but we survived the first round. We survived the first round. Chess Pats are UK. You, you, you're like my lucky charm. You're always welcome here. Um, but come again, please. Come again. Chessmaster 303, hello to you, sir. Your first time on the stream? You're more than welcome. 
As soon as you turned up Chess Pats UK, things are okay. But look at this. This is such a wet move. I mean, I'm going Queen C7. And I started to get really worried here. He might be able to go Knight G5. Uh, I won't play moves on the board. But he might be going Knight G5 takes. Queen H5 check. Blooming heck, that would be scary. I think if he went Knight G5, I'd go F5 and just pray. But the way he played it, this was actually a very clever move. Opening up my position. Okay, so now we've got an, an easier game. Which is good. We've got white pieces. This should be a, this should be a walk in the park. A park laid with landmines, broken glass, and a lot of skag heads. So, um, only a Russian 2900 Grandmaster. And um, well, let's just, let's just play my normal stuff here. I, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna play uh, D4s today. And this opening, I can't remember this one. It's just why can't I remember what to do here? Um, which is really annoying. I should I should remember these lines. So I'm just going to play normal moves. I'm getting this one, maybe. But I don't think I'm playing for an advantage here. Just playing. I'm just trying to get into the game. Right, G3 must be the way to to develop this bishop. If I can get this in castles, I, I'm 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 reasonably happy the bishop on g2 looks nice i'm playing simple simple chess at the moment i want to take here if he captures maybe bishop f6 is a move he can play when i have to move my knight and then he doubles my pawns which is a little bit annoying so of course he's played the most annoying move now can i go here and try this well, I'm going to go here because otherwise I feel I'm worse if I have to take here with a pawn. And when you're playing someone at this level, you don't want to just get a worse position. You have to fight. So a6, I will take on d5. Most probably. And I'm now going to just try and finish this rather shobby development of mine if I can castle I'm going to be very happy here I couldn't take there then because the queen coming in is much too dangerous but I want to take here and the thing is if I can get if I can swap some pieces off his queen side is bad and my bishop is very strong so um, let's just castle and we're going to go here and come back with a knight, which feels okay. It feels like I was, con considering I wasn't so confident in this opening again. Uh, this is like uh, the semi Tarash, and I, I've, I've looked at this line. It's quite a rare line that my opponent plays, but I've forgotten uh, basically the, the correct way to, to play the position. So we have a structure here which seems fairly normal and I'm putting the rook here put it on an open file and again I'm just going to try to play sensible moves maybe this is the way that we're going to go I'd like to get a clamp on this pawn but it's really not easy to do so which is annoying and he has got I think a good isolated pawn position now can we move the bishop and threaten that pawn well I will try and now let's go and try and grab the bishop pair here I'm not worried about him taking on a2 because his bishop get is, is in some trouble I thought he should probably flick in a bishop d5 to try and get rid of it okay I say I'm not worried about this obviously now I'm worried about it because I didn't think it was playable here queen over here so he has just grabbed that pawn so b3 queen here and no easy solution there so we should have compensation anyway so we we, we don't need to panic i think 
but um, we've got to prove some comp for this pawn, right? So I said I wasn't worried about this, but obviously now, now I am a little bit worried. Uh, okay, so let's 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 go here anyway, um, and play this move. Do I have enough for a pawn? I'm not sure. I mean, I, I I can take this one back, but then my light squares are very weak. So I'm I'm more inclined to keep the bishop pair and to um, keep some pressure on his his structure here. Bishop takes, pawn takes, rook takes. Maybe maybe this is this is okay, but I I don't really like my position over here. Okay, so sensible another sensible move from my opponent, just hitting hitting my squares and I don't really want to play f3 of course now knight b4 I can take on c8 hopefully this pawn is a bloody nuisance isn't it something a little bit dodgy now I don't know if he can play this but my bishop doesn't want to be trapped behind that pawn that's that that is clear um, in the position will I take on h6 probably why the hell not so he's defending against that one we'll just probe probe his pieces somewhat got to be a useful move this one Let's get the king out of the queen's view. And now probably better here if I can hold my nerve <coughs> in the position. Hold your nerve for goodness sake. What is that move? That's a pile of crap. Oh, it's a mouse slip, that one. Why can't I win this bloody position? How do we win this? How do we win this position? Muppet. God, what's happening? I thought I was mate. Get in there! Boom! 
more like it, isn't it? That's the way we play chess. Come on, my son. Come on, my son. Yeah. Oof. And we managed to hold our nerve there a little bit. We managed to... You were shaking. I'm always shaking. I, I can't, you know... I, I, <laughs> my hand is always shaking. That was all right. I, I don't know what the standard of the game was like, but um, we kind of kept... We didn't well we we didn't lose control did we which was which was a nice nice change yeah 